Chariot One Posture, Ek Rat Asan. The chariot postures evoke the lessons in the great Indian epic, the Mahabharata. The Mahabharata, literally meaning epic India or great India, contains the dialogue between Arjun and Krishna, which contains the essence of making life's choices. The Gita, one of the most sacred texts of the Hindus, and often regarded as a book that formalizes the description of yoga, contains Krishna's guidance to Arjun to do his duty when faced with life and death decisions. The chariot is a metaphor for our physical body, and the charioteer is our higher self, guiding us to peace and enlightenment. When you approach the chariot postures, consider who's driving your chariot. Are the reins freely flapping around without proper inner guidance? Are you giving instruction to the horses? Representing your senses. The chariot posture helps train all levels of ourselves. So we may experience stillness, stability, increased awareness, and peace of mind. This chariot posture strengthens the chest, upper back, and arms. For the chariot postures, you will need a dora, a one meter length of fabric. Begin in Tadasan, mountain pose. Stand tall, holding the dora at your side. Take a deep breath. Feel centered and stable. Take the dora at its edges in each hand. Raise your arms. Lift the chest. Shift your weight to one side. Fix your gaze. Raise the opposite knee as high as you can, flexing the foot. Place the center of the dora on the shin, just below the knee. Lift the elbows. Bring the thumbs close to the chest. Keep the chest broad, throat open. Stay balanced. Pull in the reins, elbows lifted. Feel the tug of the horses. Press your knee away. Take three breaths. Release. Move your body to relax the shoulders and hands. Prepare for the other side. Use your drishti, your unwavering focus, to stay balanced. Hold for three breaths. Release, relax. Feel the pleasure of challenging yourself. 